Good morning YouTube, this is Tula. Uh, today is my ten 20th day of uh, writing a copper plate and I thought I'll make a little uh, progress video. So this is the first day I started and this I wrote today and I'm sure you can uh, see that I have improved indeed and let's see. So as I said, this is the first day I was trying to write cursive and I was watching uh, Sheen from Open Ink Stand. Um, and these are my first attempts. It's all done with a um, dip pen, a pointed pen. And this was a different nib. The next day I decided to try um, copper plate. I like the look of copper plate and these are my attempt at writing copper plate for the first time. The next day I was trying different nibs. I'm practicing on plain paper so some are um, less flexible and some are much more flexible and I'm putting a lot of pressure to get the the, um, the um, thick shade lines. We are jumping from day number three to day number five and on this day I saw quite a lot of improvement I was um, trying to write um, a little more thinly. Of course it doesn't look very good on the uh, plain paper. Day number five. I'm watching my angle. I'm writing on a guide sheet with uh, slant lines that I created for myself. On the seventh day I started practicing capital letters. I have a few more pages of A. <laughs> I really uh, practiced a whole lot. Jumping to day number 11. Trying to write smaller, different nibs, different um, inks, some feather more, some feather less. And I'm trying to write um, smaller. This is also from the same day but on better quality paper and uh, the paper makes a lot of difference. Um, your thin lines on plain paper they uh, the paper absorbs them much more and they appear thicker than they would if you would uh, make the same kind of line on a different uh, high quality paper. So this was day 11, this is day 14. You can see that I'm consistently getting better I think. I'm still getting distracted and um, misspelling words or just forgetting letters. On to day 17 and I'm feeling more comfortable with my capital letters and trying just to get um, more flow into it. I'm, I've been putting a lot of emphasis on the connecting lines. And this is from yesterday. This is a better quality paper. It's very quiet here usually, but once in a while a car goes by. Okay, so here I was trying to write the same text with the same ink and the same nib. One with applying more pressure and getting the thick uh, downstrokes and one trying to write very thinly 
and this was also written yesterday on a very nice um, recycled old paper I found don't ask me the brand so yeah you can see a lot of difference and as I wrote this is today and this is my starting point I can't believe it took me so many years to realize that uh, practice does pay off okay this is it see you next time thank you for watching